That's a nice little cutaway. Might just get to the boundary rape. It will. Good start there for Lyndon and James, and they'll need that. Oh. That short ball is an edge, and it's taken. The short ball ploy has worked. Lyndon James, who has batted beautifully for 56. Well, his innings this morning has come to an end pretty quickly. Oh, got him. Got him. That is the end of the innings. Daniel Hogg has his maiden first class wicket. A beauty of a delivery. Brett Hutton was unsure whether to have a little dab, whether to remove his bat. Well, again, probably be a couple more if Parkinson can get there. He can't. A boundary just too straight from Ben Rain there. Opens the face of Mead. I think that's going to run away for four. There's no third in there. Tend not to. <laughs> that's Ryan Campbell's bugbear, but that is the very much a thing in English county cricket. So Mead gets a boundary, relieves a little bit of pressure. There's a, there is a lot of pressure as well on right now. Two, seven, four for sixes. Hogg comes in and manages to squeeze it through the gap there. Slater, up. The third slip and galley. Pulled. Shouts of catch it. It was up in the air for a little while. Heads on hands. You can look at that. You can't quite see it in shot. But keeper, first slip, second slip, and gully. There's that one. That's just too straight. And Hasiba me it's lovely when he plays that little shot. The little tickle around the corner. It's a really flowing movement. That was the half chance of catch. But Hamid punches it down the ground. Invading the... Uh, Diving man at mid on. Daniel Hogg to start the morning off. And again, just tickles this one down towards the third man kind of area. It's vacant though. The consistent way they've bowled, but when you've got Hamid doing that, just taking a step forward and flicking off to the leg side on his pads, then he's going to be a little bit more difficult. 31 unbeaten now. So scores there, yeah, that's it. Pulled, caught behind, down the leg side, twice in the game. Hasib Hamid stands there because he cannot believe it. He made 44 in the first innings. Ooh. Has that gone down? I think awesome. it might have just got through. Definitely felt sound, there was, sounded like there was, uh, there was bat on it. And it's been signalled as runs from the umpire. Catch and gone him. Yeah, little tickle. Ben Slater, he tickled a couple in the first, just before lunch. In fact, it's not Ben Slater. It's Freddie McCann. Flicked into the gap between mid-on and mid-wicket. I think that's going to race away to the boundary. Chase is going to be in vain. Sports systems work as Delayda comes in. Shot, Korov catch it, goes over the head of the leaping man. And it's going to go one bounce and four. Drives and finds the gap as well. Punched into the ground first on contact and then races away through the side. And that will be another four down the track. So invite Slater onto it, but... Slater's timed that well. A little maybe too wide as well for Parkinson. It's slashed through the offside 4-4. Four -four. T will be at 3.45 come what may. Big shout for LBW and he's got him. Ben Fitzpatrick's finger went straight up. Shortly followed by that of the umpire. To take catches four. And he's driven. Typical isn't it? For <laughs> to a boundary. It brings up. Ben Slater's 50, 53 from 111 balls. He's batted nicely. He's played some nice shots. Don't know how long he'll keep going, though, for. That's the problem, isn't it? Probably won't overball him. Oh, a little miscommunication between the wickets. Out. And have they got him? Well yes. Fielded. Jogging back. I think that's Slater that's going back to the pavilion <coughs> after just making his half century. I mean, by the way, if anyone's listening, it says, Sam, you're absolutely wrong. Don't mind that too much. They do mind that because it's four runs, but oh, through the hands at it. Chances Jacko's. though, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Boulders never like going for runs, but the captain won't mind that too much. But where does it go? From the leg side onto the offside, but still behind. 
That's wide and driven through the legs. Shot. Here's a well-timed shot. Rain will jog to meet the ball to the boundary rope. Maybe it's just too many. Two games too many, perhaps. It's a good shot for four. Pulled along the ground by Matt Montgomery, oh. who's been watchful. And I only throw that in because if you reduce it by two, going to that trialist pull quite quick and quite a lot. It's a nice shot there from Haynes. And it will just race over onto the boundary like as well. What was going to be a maiden? Fly it up and hammered by Haynes. Gets past the diving field. The man chasing. And it will just to be to avail. Driven. Four runs. Sure. Nice shot from Matt Montgomery. He's a good player. He's going to put those balls away. Just over pitch slightly from Hogg. Moves on to 16. And that's the 150 up. If you're going Borthwick for a couple overs. And that one's driven hard and save your legs for both bat and fielder. First run to the new ball and that's the thing about the new ball. Will fly away much more quickly. Going to be a boundary and that boundary brings up Jack Haynes is 50. Well played 100. Crunched. Absolutely crunched on the front foot there from Montgomery. Edge gone! Finally! Scott Borthwick takes the catch. Daniel Hogg gets the breakthrough with the new ball. It's exactly what Darren were waiting for. It's exactly what we were building up towards. Oh, oh. in! There are good leaves and there are bad leaves. And that is a very bad leave for Luke Fletcher, who shouldered arms, perhaps on length, definitely on line. It's nipped back, though, and clipped the top of off stump. Scott Borkwick has gone racing away. Up and pushed away. It's a nice time shot. Well played there from Jack Haynes. Width and whipped away from Haynes. And there's the danger when you try and respond tonight. Going to get four there, I think. No third. John Bland will be fuming. Ryan Cam will be fuming. Plenty of us. To it. Oh, slower ball, was it? Edge, gone wide of slip. Did he get hand on it? I don't know if it carried. Rain looks away. It looked almost like he'd rolled his fingers on that, Ben Rain. He definitely tried something a little bit different. Has made him play. He's played it successfully. And that will be stumps. The end of a brilliant day's cricket. 